What's up everyone, this is Saint Sight and I one back once again for some more Let's Play The Guided Fate Paradox. In the last part, we started off our journey and we managed to complete the first of many prayers that, as God, we must accomplish. Unfortunately, I did not, I did not uh, get the opportunity to do the training that I wanted to do because Right afterwards, we immediately have to go into the next damn chapter. So, let's continue on, shall we? Please. Aw oh, man, more work? I was really enjoying my life as a typical high school student. I believe you misspoke, Lord. You must have meant... I was really enjoying my day out with my cute little sister. That's the furthest thing from the truth I've ever heard. I am sorry, but as long as there are faithful individuals praying and wishing to God, you will never have a proper vacation. That is just how many creatures depend on and long for God's guiding hand. I hope you can understand. Okay, okay, I got it. The world's coming to an end. Oh no, Judgment Day is right around the corner. <gasps> huh? What's up? N nothing. It was nothing at all. Okie dokie, Lord. Let us get to work. This time, the one who chose the wish for us to answer was... While I am wholly unworthy, it was I, Galshian Himakawa, who chose this wish. Phew, that's actually a bit of a relief. If it's you who chose it, I expect that it won't be anything too weird. Hmm, did I just receive God's judgment? I'm not grand enough to pass judgment on anyone, but of all the angels I've met, you're the most... decent, I guess. Huh. So you're saying that you cannot let your guard down around the others. How forthright of you. However, even if I may look as such to you, I may not be as decent as you believe. Oh, seriously? That sucks for me. <laughs> Please judge me after you have borne witness to the wish I have chosen. I wish you the very best of luck, Lord. And Lilia, I entrust God's safety to you. I will not fail you, Sir Galshion. Okay, let us go. Are you prepared to guide more fates? Hell yes. Nothing's gonna surprise me now. My, you are so reliable. Okie dokie, then once again, I shall accompany you as your personal angel. it is. Zombies only pop up in games or movies. A real zombie, huh? 
This is exactly what those of the dead things were talking about. Um, of the dead? If you slap that at the end of a title, man, it's the best. Any story immediately becomes a zombie apocalypse thriller. Golly, I have never heard that one before. So, if we called it Celestia of the Dead, what kind of story would result? Probably something like, all the angels get turned into zombies and God has to fight them all in order to survive! Well, well, well! Quite the innovative idea! It will surely become a famous blockbuster hit in the United States! That's pretty specific of you. I'm not sure if you're trying to praise me or not. Well, whatever. Liliel, please don't tell me that the zombie is the one praying to God. Wow! As expected of God, such brilliant deductions could only be divine! That zombie is indeed the one who prayed. Man, really? God even has to answer the prayers of a zombie? God's love must shower all living things. His love is infinitely deep and forever sacred. All living things, huh? But this is a zombie. It's dead. That's kind of the point. Damn it, Galshion. Looking like a decent enough guy. Picking this wish? What's his problem? Lesson two, Lord of the Dead. Just when I think things can't get any fucking weirder, they have to slap this on. Yes, I know about that gauge. Basically, it's your true god <laughs> mode. And you don't want to use it for anything other than an absolute necessity. Also, you're going to be hearing these stupid, very stupid zombie sounds for the rest of the goddamn area. Love picking my ass. And yes, you can chuck tombstones. Scrape my elbow bit. That's asshole. Absolute defense. Yes, Yummy. He ain't taking this down. Uh, I up at that. It says zero, but it actually inflicts like six damage. Also at the very end, I see. Getting better if she gets hit than I do. Are 
evil eye. Not yet. Poison. Perhaps I should have gotten some kind of healing item. Defense is so important. Get out of here. Weak. Get you and your beefy waffles out of here. Zombies are ganging up on a zombie. Maybe they intend to become zombie cannibals. Zombies can't be cannibals. Is that so? My, you are rather versed when it comes to zombies. Here, I thought this was your first time seeing one. It's a standard of the dead rule. I may not look it, but I'm kind of an encyclopedia when it comes to horror films. A male high schooler in the height of his adolescence, watching horror movies at night with his bedroom door locked. How lewd! Don't imagine weird, made-up situations. Apologize to the pure and honest horror film aficionados across the world right now. Setting that outburst far to the side, is not the zombie getting beaten up wearing a familiar-looking scarf, Lord? Yeah, and those subservient eyes. There's no mistaking those puppies. That's our praying zombie, all right. For the sake of granting his wish, I must lend him my aid. This is the Fate Revolution Circuit. So all things can be done as God commands. Let's do it. Huh. Huh. Hey, Chisa. Uh, Chisa. Nope. Uh, I'm not even getting touched. Just give me a bite of your brains! 
don't tell me that his wish is to eat human flesh. No way! Sir Galshion usually shows the most common sense, so he would never pick such a mean wish. There must be something else. Well, I hope so. If he's the type to pick a zombie's wish, I don't think I'm gonna put my trust in him again. G God, don't ignore me! Hey, don't cling on to me. For now, just keep a good distance from me. I mean, wow, you smell like rotting death. This thing is a pain in the neck. Uh, hey, you have a wish or something, right? Try telling it to me. A wish? You'll grant my wish? God, will you really? Hmm, probably, if it's not too insane. I don't want to be bullied. So, fight back. But I'm really weak. So, train. Ew, training. That's so hard and tiring. Then, run away, maybe? I can't run. If I overdo it, my legs might snap right off. You never run out of excuses, do you? Shouldn't zombies have more drive? You'd go all out for some human flesh, right? I knew of zombies that would even sprint. Some could even stick to ceilings. Even when on fire, they'd keep on keeping on. Zombies is so wrong! We crossed the line into wrong the moment zombies started to talk. But you're a man, zombie or not. You've got to do it with a bang. Ah, no way I can't! That's why I pray to you! And now God came here to mock me. I'm so sad, I can't stop my tears from flowing out of my eye holes. Jeez, you're so annoying. Stop crying at the drop of a hat. His legs will fall off my ass. Running zombies are wrong, he says. Dude, he's running away with all his might. It would appear that the zombie wishes to no longer be bullied. Well, yeah. I don't think it's going to be that easy. Especially if he keeps, keeps talking like that. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I can't see shit. That's better. Zombie games typically fire or holy magic is the best way to take them out. Since I'm running, since I'm not uh, fresh out of holy magic, fire will have to do. Poison. Let's grab as much cash as I can. I won't lose. 
That's better. All you got. I'm dead. You're dead before. Weak. I definitely need to get some attack boosts in a bit later. I need to do at least some damage. Let's see. That'll help. Stop arriving late! Uh, oh, um, yes, I I'm sorry! Where's your spirit? Moan from the bottom of your rotten innards! Uh, I'm so sorry! Yeesh, that was like a buzzing mosquito. A rotten, weak zombie like you needs another round of my thorough training. It's gonna get rough, so ready yourself! I'll train you until your brains ooze out of your ears! But really, if you can withstand my harsh training, you'll be able to snack on fresh human flesh as often as you'd like. My training is made so that even weaklings like yourself can feast on delicious human meat. So, are you filled with excitement? Um, but, Sergeant? Fool! Who said you could talk? I won't let you open that mouth without my permission! Uh, I'm as unreasonable as ever. You idiot! It seems my message isn't getting across. <laughs> I, I get it! I really do! Y yes, indeed! Um, may I ask you a question? Sergeant, permission to speak? Say it like that, you stupid fool! S S Sergeant! P permission to speak? Permission granted! Spit it out already! I I'm afraid of humans. Yesterday, a veteran zombie was hung on a tree upside down while people turned him into Swiss cheese with their boomsticks! And all you did was watch it happen? You left a veteran zombie officer to die while you freaked out and ran away? But, but, but I was just so, so scared! You're unbelievable! Don't you have an ounce of pride as a zombie? Today's training will be a special course. I'll beat that rotten cowardice right out of you. So get ready. Ah! Hmm. It may sound weird to say, but I feel like things will be better for him if he just gets trained. That may be so, but a wish is a wish. You must do your best to grant it. Yeah, I'm kind of reluctant, but I guess I should help guide his fate before he's spoiled rotten or something. I think it's a mite too late for that. Stronger, but still not by much. Yeah, 
early game, best to grab as much as you can. Damn poison crap. Every damn time. Bitch, that was my kill. Stuff to sell. Got a lot of grammar to learn. Been <laughs> so long for my stuff to burst. One side. Enough with the damn fire already. 